From Oscar winners to brand new moms, there are some gorgeous faces in People Magazine's 50 Most Beautiful Special Double Issue. And this year's Most Beautiful is Oscar winner Lupita Nyong'o. Beautiful. Joining us now from New York City is People Magazine senior writer Julie Jordan with more on this special double issue. Julie, good morning. Welcome to the Hampton Road Show. Good morning. Thanks for having me. I mean, need I ask why Lupita, but just go ahead and tell us. <laughs> I'll just give you the spiel. <laughs> no, she is just incredible. I'm not sure there's been anyone who has catapulted onto the scene the way she has. You know, she first started out in September at the Toronto Film Festival. Between there and March, I think she hit 65 red carpets. Uh, every single one of them, stunning, elegant, poised. This is a woman who has gone from being basically an unknown to a beauty and fashion icon um, in a matter of months. So, you know, it's just it was fitting to put her on the cover this year and most importantly because she's so appreciative she didn't think she fit the Hollywood mold you know what she saw on television growing up in Kenya was like lighter skinned people with long flowing hair and that's not what she possessed so the fact that she was she's been defined as beautiful on the cover of our magazine and for the world to see means everything for her and I love that. I mean, she's quoted, and that's what I think what resonates with people is that other little girls who look like her know that they're beautiful. And aside from Halle Berry and Beyonce, she's the third black woman to grace the cover, which is exciting in itself. Yeah, I mean, and you know, and she said she would pray to God every day to wake up lighter skinned because, you know, she had such a dark complexion. But you look, I mean, she's She's stunning. She's mm -hmm. truly amazing. And it's her presence more than anything. I sat down with her at the Plaza Hotel, and she was surrounded by this immaculate setting. And she was just humbled, humbled by the attention, humbled by the fact that this is her journey and what, you know, what she's been able to obtain. It's really amazing. I love it. All right, let's talk about some other features that are in this um, double issue. What is this uh, Naked at 34? What's, what's that all about? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so there was a recent study that said women are never more confident with their bodies than at age 34. So we thought, okay, let's go ask women to pose naked in the issue. You know, I thought we would have to convince people, but number one in line was pink. Yeah, I, she loves being naked. We know this about her, but she's so strong and so amazing. I love that she said, you know, she could stand to lose a few pounds here and there, but she'd much rather have muscles than be skin and bones. And you look at these pictures and no one's going to argue with her. And I know you guys also have something, what, not a drop of makeup and then 25 years of beauty. Yes. Yes. Well, the, the no, make, no, no makeup portfolio is always my favorite because we don't allow any makeup whatsoever. Only non-tinted moisturizer and lip balm. Like Jenna Duane Tatum, Channing's wife this year did it. And I had interviewed him for Sexiest Man Alive you know, two years back, and he kept going on and on about how beautiful Jenna was. Sitting across from her without any makeup on, it's just shocking how gorgeous she is. I mean, her eyes are like translucent. There's no wonder that boy is head over heels in love with her. That's amazing. Well, we appreciate uh, you talking with us, Julie. And again, thank you so much. Thanks for having me. And you can check out all the beautiful creatures yourself. People Magazine's special 50 Most Beautiful double issue hits newsstands tomorrow.